Hello my most amazing artist. Today we are going to do a fun and simple art project and what you need is a mat or something to put your artwork on so you don't make a mess. This will get wet so make sure it's something sturdy too. I have some cardboard here, a coffee filter, washable markers. They must be washable or it will not work and a water bottle. That is all you need and really if you don't have a water bottle you can just use water to get this wet when it's time to do that. So let me show you what we're gonna do. I'm gonna take my markers. I'm using blues and greens because it's Earth Day. So I'm gonna draw an Earth pattern on here. I'm not gonna look at it, I'm just gonna do splotches of green for land and blue for water. You can do it in whatever colors you want though. Don't worry about coloring it too nicely because it is going to blur when we put the water onto it. So I'm just drawing, like I said, random shapes for my land. One important tip to remember when coloring this in is don't color over an area that you've already colored in or it will get really wet and rip. Also don't worry about filling in all the spaces. So if you have some little white spaces showing, that's okay. I don't have it completely colored in, but it will still work. I don't really need to go back and fill in those spaces. I'm gonna get a spray bottle, and I'm gonna make sure it's on mist. If you don't have a spray bottle, like I said, you could just run this underwater. You're just gonna have to be careful that you don't get your hands all dirty. And I'm gonna spray, as you can see, this is soaked. And you can see also that the colors are blurring. This will only work with washable marker, like I said. It will blend the colors and sort of look like a tie-dye. Leave it here until it's completely dry and then you can pull it off and you can draw more designs on you. it if you want with permanent or washable marker. It's up to you. Happy creating.